the finalists in the team category for the 2016 Science Technology Innovation and Collaboration Awards are world-class team. So we have uh, several different disciplines coming together to, to make this project a success. So we've got linear accelerator expertise, we've got uh, nuclear industry expertise, and we've got uh, radio pharmacy and uh, radio chemistry expertise all coming together to help design a world first uh, vertically integrated production facility that we'll be building here in Saskatoon. We'll be servicing the North American market with this facility and uh, we're quite excited about the prospects of bringing a new source of molybdenum, which is a highly sought after radioisotope to market right here from Saskatoon. Having a team and uh, doing some great work is one thing, but to be honored and recognized by your, uh, the business community and our peers is fantastic because it is that validation that we, we, uh, we don't always get. So it's, it's nice, to, nice to have. We help companies develop processes to extract components from plant-based materials primarily and um, develop commercially viable processes for them. We have a multifunctional team here, uh, various diversities of ke chemists, uh, we have some microbiologists, we have uh, engineers, uh, and we work with other teams uh, in, in the company here such as materials management, quality assurance, safety, and pilot plant operations and maintenance for example. It's very much an honor to be to be recognized in, through this nomination uh, by Srita and uh, this, this award. Uh, we're more well known outside of Saskatchewan than we are in Saskatchewan, so this means a lot to us, to our, our people, that locally um, friends and family may understand a bit more about our company and appreciate uh, the value that we take to the world. Well, here at Saskatchewan Polytechnic in Prince Albert, uh, we are all affiliated with Natural Resources Technology and that team uh, includes uh, just such a wide range of individuals that are all have one thing in common and that is conservation, natural resources and, uh, and management of our natural resources. We not only draw on the skills of our uh, resource and environmental law instructors, but we also draw on the, uh, the skills of our foresters and our wildlife tech, uh, biologists and so on. So this technology is actually gonna uh, really open the door for collaboration going forward as well. Uh, Science, Technology, Innovation and Collaboration Award is, uh, is an excellent initiative. I think our, our team uh, in particular uh, would look forward to the honor of, uh, of being represented. Well, our science outreach team delivers science outreach programming to grade school students. So what we want to do is get them excited about science and change their perspective about science and have a better understanding of career pathways in the sciences. So there's a number of different programs we offer. Our science ambassador program uh, pairs our university students going up into northern communities for four to six weeks living in northern Aboriginal communities and working alongside teachers in the schools delivering those hands-on activities and getting youth excited about science. I think it's really important to celebrate science, technology, innovation and present that to the community and these awards certainly do that. It promotes the importance of science literacy, it promotes the importance of uh, innovation and education in order to be able to solve current local problems, future local problems, global problems. It supports uh, different ways of knowing and thinking about the world that's around us and I think it sends the message to the community that science literacy really is the foundation of um, living in the 21st century.